T. So, T. to continue with what I was saying last week again, um, they're right now they're just saying I O and T, which is yes and no. As Roger is just pointing out the different animals in his picture book. Um, well, Killy Mbembe's got a couple of different definitions, um, but that's what they call the animal. It's been interpreted as he who divides the river or stops the flow of the river. Um, in either way, it's reference to a big animal that blocks rivers. Um, filmed this all at Grant Park. Over this particular video, I think we filmed the entire thing in either one or two days. Which again, I mean, it's 14 minutes long, it's not that huge. Um, I was going to originally just be doing a remake of a different video, and in the process of writing the script for that, I just wrote a completely different story. Now, if you watch, this is this is one of the, the few good parts where I actually have something to tell you that's actually informative. Um, so he is looking at this map, and he sees the waterfall, and he goes, oh, I've got to head north. And instead of him heading, you saw him sort of go off to the side there, well, he actually went to head along the path that's going sideways instead of the path that he's on now. So he was actually going to be heading west instead of north. Does it really make a big deal? No. But it's something I can tell you, and not everyone's going to know that unless they've watched these videos on YouTube. Or I think I also mentioned that in the behind the scenes or it's in the outtakes, something like that. And it's just more of him walking. The background music I've got from a website called freebiblemusic.com. They do, oh, that's a nice footprint. Um, they do uh, just Bible verses put to music. And one of the artists has uploaded a karaoke version of the songs that it's strictly the music and then you can sing over them. And so I went and placed just that music just randomly in the background. So it doesn't, I mean the music doesn't hide directly into the show at all, but it's at least there to help cover up static and things like that. And here I am. I finally made it into the show. I was actually going to do a separate part to the show, which I just never did. Um, it was going to be Close Encounter with a Dinosaur. Probably like from Gunther's View or something like that. And it was basically just going to be it was going to be the same show from here to the end and then instead of cutting over to Roger on that next day it was going to just continue with Gunther and it was basically going to be what happened to Gunther that led up to that point where he was hurt on the side of the road um, which basically all it was was he ran into the natives and the native scared him. He went running away, tripped and fell and hurt his ankle. But you saw him at his tent a little bit more, getting the fire ready. You saw him go seeing the waterfall, drawing up the map, putting the map in the pocket, things like that. And I just never had the time to go back and film that. So it's just never going to actually be done. Unless I decide to completely redo this episode, which I don't really want to do, I could do, but I I don't have the, the available time for that. Um, so that's more than likely just never gonna get done. And there was never a monster there for him to see. It was all just CGI work. Um, there are, I think we put a couple of footprints down on this side, on the ground. Um, but I, I mean, we end up trailing him the next day, or what ends up being the next day. And it basically goes, oh look, here's one, here's one, here's one, and there are absolutely no footprints there. And we've got another 30 seconds going, so well, let's hope we get the food out in time so I can tell you about that. Well, how to make it last so, so I made chicken drumsticks for us to eat for lunch, what do you think that's gonna but chicken would, you know, go bad not being refrigerated. So we had to think of something that wouldn't. And yeah. what better to make chicken. chicken drumsticks yeah. out of than Rice Krispie Krispies. Squares? So we made a batch of Rice Krispie Squares. We sort of cut them into the leg of the drumstick, squished them around with our hands, and perfect chicken drumsticks. I couldn't have thought of a better thing myself. <laughs>
which I thought of those. Here are five minutes is up, so I will catch you next week for the final episode.